Hello and welcome back to the workbench. I have got the MN99S version 1 on the bench today because we are going to try out these things. I have been threatening for a while or saying for a while that I was working on trying to stiffen up the sidewalls of these tires. And I had an idea about putting these guys in, these little plastic things, in on either side and let the foam in the middle do its job. I don't know if it's going to work. Haven't seen it done, so it probably won't work, but we're going to find out together. And uh, so let's give it a shot. I also trying out some new batteries. These are not sponsored. I found them on the Amazon things. You know how they send you the advertisement says, hey, we've got these batteries. They're cheap. And they were. So let's try them and see how good or bad they are. Well, let's see how they they do fit. Once you get them figured out, good. That turned on. We'll get it set to the right model. All right. And power. Oh, here's the power switch. It's been a while. All right. This has the Fusion Mini 16 in it. So it's got plenty of power. It also has a two-speed gearbox and a lot of other custom accessories to it. So let's get to it and see what it does on the old track over here. Let's see what we can figure out. Okay, that back tire is... Showing a little bit of compression there. They're fully compressed on the back over there. And I have, that is 0.06, so we are 30 degrees. That is about as far as it's going to go, and we are at 37 and a half degrees. Let's get these things installed, but this is all hex hardware now. Let's get this tire off of here. So inside we have the plastic piece, we have the foam. I think I need to take the plastic piece or the foam out. These are printed, I think I printed these two layers high. These are quite thin. Half a mil thin, and they're made out of PE, printed at a PETG, so they won't melt out in the sun. All right, there's one, and let's see, let's compare it to a new one. Oh yeah, it does a little bit. I don't know if it's going to, well, it is a little bit stiffer on the side, but it still allows some give. We're gonna see if it works. I don't know if it's gonna work or not. Well, we're gonna find out together. I'll change the other tire on this side. We'll see how it works, so be right back. Not 
What are we on degrees here? 30 degrees is where we saw a lot. We are at 32 degrees right now. I think this little experiment might work. All right, there's where she wants to start to tip. And that's at 42 degrees. And the back isn't as collapsed as I thought it was going to be. I think that this is actually an easy way to do this. I'll post these files up on the up on my uh, sites where I post these things. I'll have a link in the description down below. But yeah, I am uh, pleasantly surprised. I'm going to install this now on the rest of my rigs. Thanks for watching. Happy crawling.